Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video here on my channel. About a week ago, a new patch came out, version 5.5.01, and it added a new event, the scroll event. You probably heard of it. You probably heard of it. That's what you're seeing right now on the screen, that sweet new diamond badge. <laughs> and trust me, you don't want to miss anything. So watch the whole video and have fun. Let's roll the intro, get this video started and take a look what the new update bring along. Yeah, but basically the new event, it's all about the new event and as you can see they added new PPS items, 7 to be exact. I'm not gonna name them, but they are pretty good. I think the worst one was like 5%. I think the best one was about 4 no it was 40%. Then there was one with 30%, then one with 5, with 30, with 15, I think there were 2. I think one with 10, basically they were extremely good, okay? But they were expensive too. Really expensive. They cost a lot of scrolls. Scrolls basically the new thing they got added. Um, yeah, you can. Yeah, you can see that I just received six of them. Basically, with them you can buy the PBS items or with the fragments that you can craft into scrolls in the furnace. The thing is that they were so expensive that they had to <laughs> fix that. So some days later, a new version <laughs> rolled around. And it was version 5.5.1. All the prices for the PPS items got divided by two. To that, the scroll crafting time has been reduced to 30 minutes from one hour. This is this is a good thing because <laughs> if one scroll takes one hour to craft, a bad player wouldn't be able to do a lot. Because even if they crafted um, scrolls for 5 days straight would be like 130 scrolls, which is not that much in this event. You probably need about more than a thousand scrolls for everything, so you need a lot of spacious speed for that, uh, yeah, for that event. I personally had no big problem getting all the items from time, um, but yeah, new players might have the problem because w w half an hour for one scroll, this is, this is a lot. But how do you get scrolls or scroll fragments? There are three main ways. The first way is opening scroll chests, of course. You can get, I would say, about 10 to 30 scroll fragments in one chest, which corresponds to about 3 to maybe 7 or 8 scrolls if you craft them together. Yeah, so if you're mobile, you can just watch two ads and get, open the chest. And so on. This is on if you are mobile, this is definitely a good way to get your scrolls. But what I personally did is farm Clisms. Clism is the new boss they added. Basically, it's not a new boss, it's just Paper Pete but reskinned. <laughs> um, yeah, it's basically Paper Pete but reskinned, and he drops scrolls. I mean, he doesn't drop scrolls, but the boss chest you get from him, it's basically like a scroll chest, but better. You can get about, I would say, 25 to 30 scroll fragments in average, you can get almost up to 50 if you're lucky. Um, so this is really good. I would farm clisms as you can see now. I like to farm them because they are quite easy and they, they make fun to be honest. And sometimes you can draw a heart which is awesome. <laughs> but yeah, this is a good way to get scrolls. This is a very good way to get scrolls. And the third way is doing the quests. This is what you should normally do. On the bottom right you can see this little scroll and if you click on it you can see three quests that you can do and if you complete all of them you get about yeah, maybe 5 to 10 scroll fragments in average. So yeah this is a decent way, probably for new players it's the best way if they don't have the picks. If they're not that good at defeating bosses or they don't have acting with a very long ability it might be even faster for a new player to farm the event boss. But I personally farm bosses because it makes more fun. And yes, I know you can also collect scrolls because they spawn randomly. Uh, yeah, that will yeah maybe give you 50 to 100 scrolls over the event span, which is decent. But if you think about it, you need well over 1,000, so it's not gonna help you too much, will it? No, it won't. Then it also added. 
three new pickaxes, but I'm gonna go over them in an, another video because three new pickaxes, that's a lot, and they're not just fire pickaxes. I have to get scroll pickaxe first though. This is gonna be a problem because the event is almost over. If you're watching this, it is over by the way. Um, but yeah, we received the beast pickaxe, which is basically explosion pickaxe. We received the scroll pickaxe, which I don't have, so I don't really know if it's good, but it should be a fire pickaxe, but better I didn't really understand what they mean. And then there's the tritium pickaxe, which is a P for speedrunning, because it can spare you a lot of time, you don't have to craft tritium anymore in the furnace, this is awesome. But as I said, I'm gonna make a special video for that next week. Um, yeah, and they also fixed some bugs, for example, the scroll quests can't be closed on several occasions and yeah, they fixed several other bugs, but these are minor bugs, I would say minor bugs. And <clears throat> there's one more thing, one more thing, and that's the beast abilities. Right now I can't tell you how the beast abilities will work since the event right now for me isn't over. I can just tell you, you get a beast ability every time you play a scroll event and you have to play it to quest 30 and beat quest 32. That means it's not that easy. For a new player it might be really challenging to get hashtag 30 done. Um, for me or for a better player it's not that hard. I mean if you have some time on your hands you can definitely do it. Even if you're not that good of a player, if you just prestige 10 or something like that, you can definitely do it. My friend did it too and he's only like... 13 prestige so yeah you can do it it's, it just takes some time and then you will get a beast ability the beast ability as i said i can't tell you what it does there are five different abilities there is left leg right leg left arm right arm and then it seems like the body the torso whatever i don't know it's basically the main part and if you collect all five of those you can unleash the beast <laughs> Uh, but I don't know what it means. So basically, we first have to wait till five scroll events passed, and I will have to play them through. And then I, we can see what the beast actually means. But yeah, beast ability, it, it looks awesome, okay? If it's that good, <laughs> I mean, it seems pretty good, okay? It has to be OP. To get one, you have to play a full event. It will take you hours. If the pickaxe isn't S tier, or maybe A tier, I'm gonna be really mad, because I don't think you can level it up, I don't know how it works, if there is a different UI for it, or if it just appears as a normal ability, I don't know if you can level it up, I don't know if you get random um, abilities, or if you get always the one that displays at the event goals, I really don't know anything about beast abilities yet, only that you can get them from the event once, one per event, and you have to play the event through to get them. But I'm gonna make a video about beast abilities when maybe some more scroll events have passed. Maybe I'm just gonna make one when I can unleash the beast because it would be quite stupid to make a video if I only have like two abilities. So I'm probably gonna make a whole beast video if I have all the abilities. But till then, um, that's basically it. That's basically everything the event added so far. I have to say I love the scroll event. I, I mean not like extremely innovative or something it's just another cool event but the beast abilities those are important I hope at least they are important and the pickaxes they are cool as well so it's definitely better than the garden event I have to say Alpha if you're watching this I like that event and I like the I like the pickaxes too and if the beast abilities are good I <laughs> I'm loving this event because and think about it, if I play this event five times how long is it gonna take? I mean, for it to appear five times this event, it's gonna take a year or something like that, because even if we have like a scroll event every second month, it's gonna take almost a year. And then I'm gonna have to complete it all the time. If I if I miss one or two, then it's gonna take like half a year more. And this is, this is gonna take some time. So don't expect <laughs> the beast guide video whatever in like a month or something, more like in a year, maybe two. Uh, yes, sorry, but Pig Crafter takes its sweet time. And as I said, next Monday is gonna be all the three new pickaxes from the scroll event reviewed and with all the information you need. So this is like a pickaxe review XXL. And yeah, you don't want to miss that. 
And how do you don't miss that? The answer is click subscribe and hit the bell. And while you're down there, click the like button. You probably liked the video. I mean, you watched her now. So that, that, that's a reason for liking. Just like the video. Have a great day. Check out the description if you want to join my Discord. Don't tag me in the comments, please. The link is always down in the description. Guys, please. And then have a great day. I wish you a very good day as well. And bye. And that made no sense. I just said have a great day and I wish you a great day. <laughs> okay, yeah. Just, just subscribe, like, share this video, whatever. And bye. Have fun.